Hi, okay, this is my first tutorial, and uh, a lot of questions that people have asked is um, how to install Moonshell, the media player, on your DS by um, by Moonlight. Um, well, see, it's really easy, and this tutorial isn't only for the Max Media Dock, it's for any other cartridge, because it'll work. It's a really easy installation, if you have any questions, just comment me. I'll take you step by step, and uh, I'll show you how to do this thing. And Lord Reefa, you suck balls. Okay, so, um, just follow along and we'll get started. Okay, so this is how you get Moonshell on your flash cart or Max Media Dock. Okay, so, we're gonna go to the web because we're gonna download it. I already have it downloaded, but this is just to show you guys who want to get it on. Okay, so... You're gonna Google search... You're going to want to Google search Moonshell. Moonshell Wiki. And, uh, okay, so. Click enter. Now we're going to go here. Now you're going to go to external links, and you're going to go to the infantile paralysis, or whatever it is. The site's in Japanese, but some of the links are in English. So now you're going to go to moonshell version 1.71 plus 1 stable click that down here it will say do not mix moonshell with the file of an old version whatever don't listen to that it makes no sense whatsoever okay so now we're going to click on version 1.71 this one right here download version 1.71 plus 1 click that I'll give you two mirrors, they're exactly the same. But you're gonna wanna but if you want a zip file, you're gonna want this one. So I click it. Save it wherever you want to. I'll ask you for to save it somewhere. Well, I already have it saved, so I'm not gonna download it. Well anyway, after it downloads I'm gonna close this window now. After it downloads, you're going to want to go to the location where you saved it. And I saved mine in documents. Oh, I'm running this on Vista, but this will work on XP also. Um, Guys who are using a Mac, I don't know if this will work on yours because the file is unexecutable. So if you find some way to run an executable file on a Mac, that's great. Okay, so um, this is where I save my Moonshell folder. And then, okay, so open, oh, my Moonshell folder, the file name will be different than yours, because I ever made mine to, moon, to Moonshell. But uh, open up the Moonshell folder that you downloaded, and you're going to go to this thing called Setup. Click, click it. It'll ask you to run it, just press OK. And then, uh, okay, uh, this, there's going to be a Setup Moonshell version 1.71 pop-up. And on that pop-up, it'll you're gonna select your removable drive. I don't remember which removable drive mine is, so I'm gonna go back to computer. Okay, removable disk drive. Okay, yeah, mine's J. Okay, right, so select your removable drive. Mine's J. Yeah. Okay, so press OK. Then here, don't touch any of it. The only thing you're going to want to touch is this. Select your flash cart. And uh, since mine is Max Media Dock, I'm going to pick these two. See, it automatically knows it. No, it doesn't. I just selected this last time. But, um, anyway, uh, so. Uh, select your flash cart. For people running the Max Media Dock, pick either one of those. It doesn't matter. Um, okay. So then you're gonna click check on setup. And then it's gonna extract all those files to your flash cart, or your compact flash cart, or whatever. So it's doing it. Oh, and the file's really small. It's only 4.7 megabytes. Oh, running, running, 
and running. <clears throat> oh, while this still runs, Lord Rifa, you suck balls. I'm a fat ass, look at me. I think I'm so cool. I want to help you with the NDS homebrew. <sighs> okay, well, this is almost done. Uh, okay, so now it's done. Okay, so press OK, close that. Okay, so forget that last pop up. It's only on this. Okay, so now you're gonna go to my computer. Your computer, if you're on Vista, click on your Max Media Docker removable drive, and you're gonna see these two. See these two things? They're uh. Okay, for if you if Max Media Doc users, if you checked both like I did, because they're both meant for the Max Media Doc, delete one of them. It doesn't really matter. Yes. And if I were you, I'd remove it to Moonshell. I'd rename it to Moonshell. Moonshell. If you're on Vista, you want to keep the .nds because it'll change the extension, I think. Okay, so I made a folder called Programs, and that's where I put all the raw, all the, all the, uh, all my homebrew apps. And now you can see that the Moonshell folder is out here. And it doesn't, uh, so. Now that the Moonshell folder is out there, and your ROM is somewhere else, you can put the, the Moonshell ROM wherever you want. The thing that loads Moonshell, yeah, just put that wherever you want, as long as, it, as it's in your card. It'll work just fine. Okay, so, now Moonshell is in here in my Programs folder, and the Moonshell folder is out here. Okay, so now we're going to close this. We're going to safely remove, like you should, because you don't want to screw up your card. La -da 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 -da. Okay. Stop. Press OK. This now can be safely removed from the computer. Okay. We're going to close this. Disconnect. And voila. Okay, now I'll show you what the the after part I just showed you I showed you the uh, oh I'm just gonna show you like how to access it now okay so let me stop this screen capture okay so I already showed you how to install Moonshell right uh, on your Max Media Doc or any other flashcard okay now I'm gonna show you what it does really quick you'll have to go um okay so put this in the DS the ass of the DS Put it in, and I got this, oh yeah, I got the new DS, woohoo, it's old my old one, put it in here, my old DS slide, okay, so now we got this, right, now, we're gonna turn this on, let me show you what it does, okay, so on the Max Media Doc, I don't know how you other flash groups guys do it, open up the folder, or wherever you saved, your Moonshell app, right? Do not open the Moonshell app, because, yeah, well, you can if you want to, just don't mess with it, unless you're going to skin it, which I'll show you how to do next time, but go to the folder you saved it and access it. Okay, got that, it's loading, loading, blah, 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 okay. I got some MP3 files here. Show you really quick what it does. Okay, so it's cool, right? Sweet, sweet. Okay, so now I'm going to show you a video really quick. I'm going to go down to my music videos. I like jazz, so here's some jazz. It's pretty clear. This was downloaded from YouTube, so it looks kind of crappy. But you can rip DVDs using DVD fab and stuff. I'll show you how to do all this stuff next time. But uh, yeah, this is what Mood Show does. I'm sorry I didn't show you before. But yeah, that's how you install it, and it's great. And if you have any questions, just mail me or comment me. Okay, I gotta go. Bye.